All right, let's put an animated GIF right in our terminal. Uh, so yeah, we got an animated GIF right in the terminal. If you don't think that's cool, probably wrong video for you, maybe wrong channel for you, I don't know. All right, now, if you actually want to do this, you may have to switch terminal emulators, which uh, I know sounds like a big thing, but you'll be switching to a terminal emulator that's probably better than your current one. So the terminal emulator that I'm using that supports this is called Kitty. And uh, if you're using Alacrity, I think that Kitty is, you know, about the same. Like, like I prefer Kitty to Alacrity. It's definitely not a step back, in my opinion. Uh, it's also cross-platform. I love that they say cross-platform. You check and you go, oh, Linux, Mac, OS, and various BSDs. No Windows, right? They don't, yeah. Cross-platform, not that one, but cross-platform. Anyway, so it'll work on Mac and Linux, and you're probably using one of those, right? Okay, so Kitty has this idea of kittens, which are uh, programs that Kitty itself can run, and you can actually write these uh, programs. So let me jump into a uh, directory I've got here, uh, and I'm going to run one of these. So to do it, you type kitty plus kitten iCat. So this is the name of the, uh, the kitten. Now, you would set up an alias for this, right? You wouldn't type this every time. And then I type in the name of the image that I want to put on the screen here. So in this case, I've got uh, this nice picture right here. And there it goes. It shows up in my terminal. So it's it's that easy. Uh, you will have to install Image Magic, but that's probably already on your system. Okay, but it also supports animated GIFs. So if I put this here, oh, an animated GIF. So that's how you get an animated GIF in your terminal. Kitty actually has a bunch of different kittens. Uh, I have not used almost any of these, but the the diff one's kind of cool. So if we if we jump back in here and we say iCat, uh, no, we sort of say diff, and then I've got a Tom dot Jason and a Tony dot Jason. It's opening up this uh, diff. It's not even an image. I don't know. Is this HTML? I have no idea what it's doing actually here. Um, but uh, it, it shows this to me right in my terminal, uh, which again, I think is kind of cool. Okay, but maybe you actually want an animated GIF that matches your terminal background like mine. Okay, uh, first of all, you need to take an image uh, that has the same background as uh, your terminal. Okay, you need to create a JPEG or a PNG or something like that. You've got to do that first. Then you can use this app called Photomosh, uh, where you can upload different images here. Let's, let's use this one of uh, Linus here. And then you can uh, do different kinds of moshes on it. And uh, there's a whole bunch of different effects so you can figure out exactly what you want. That is kind of cool. And then last but not least, of course, you would go into your bash RC and uh, you would have a command just to run it every time, right? So I've got this kitty plus kitten iCat align left because I want it on the left here and then the uh, source of that, right? So this will work on any of my computers that have Dropbox. That's the whole thing. So now I've got an animated GIF in my terminal that shows up every time I open up uh, a new terminal. If you know of a better way of doing this or if you know of anything cool like this, please let me know. Always looking to learn. Hope you're having a great day. Bye.